Hello guys, welcome back to another RuneScape video. In today's video, I am going to show you how to do the tit farming minigame. It's very simple, it should be very quick. So, you need 31 farming to come here and uh, do this minigame. You also need 100% and Hosidius to come here. So, once you have those requirements done, uh, which what I do is make your way to uh, the south, of the Hesidius house. Just go south from the port. Uh, probably quicker transportation would be tra transporting to a house if you have a house here, or making a buying a scaling necklace and teleporting to the woodcutting guild. Once you make your way towards this part of the area, you want to enter the house, and also there's a guy here. You can talk to him, see what kind of rewards he has. Depending on how many uh, fruits that you harvest, uh, will give you a certain amount of points. You can spend the points on the scaling outfit, which is the farming outfit, which gives you, uh, I think, a 2.5% XP bonus to your farming, I think. It's something like that. And you can buy also the Grisolers, Grisolers can, which gives you a thousand, uh, a thousand charges to water. So you can charge a thousand charges into this bitch. You can also buy super compost, normal compost, some grape seeds, herb sack, seed box, and some wheat. Yeah, some of that dank weed. <laughs> so, uh, once you make your way in here, you want to go to the seat table. And if you're rank 34 to 53, you can only uh, farm me Golanova seeds. If you're only uh, rank 54 to uh, level 73, you can only farm baloney seeds, like what I like to call them. Or if you're rank 74 or higher, you can obviously farm logo bonus seeds or however the fuck you say it. So once I am higher, so I can get these seeds. So once you get the seed uh, that you can farm, you want to go inside. Don't worry about this compost because that's trash. Um, you want to fill up your watering can. Oh yeah, I'm sorry to I forgot to tell you, say. You have to get a watering can, a spade, and a seed bigger. Once you have those items as well, you want to start your farming method. Now, there's different methods, different patterns people like to do. My pattern is I like to go, as soon as you open the front door, you'll see patches. You'll see, uh, how many of these? One, two, three, four, five. You see five patches on each side. So one on the south side and one on the north side. Once you pick your side, east or west sometimes you'll find a person farming these these uh, five so if you see someone using these five or or i don't know if you see that one over there just go to this side it's no problem or just hop so once you find your your area what you want to do is if you want to follow my pattern go on the other side of the first plot you're going to farm because uh, see, I marked the plots I'm gonna use. I'm gonna use these ones right here. And I'm gonna end my rotation at this plot. At this plot. So once I end my rotation, the next rotation is gonna start obviously on this one. Because this is the first seed I'm gonna plant. So you'll see what I'm talking about right now. So, when you go open the door, come on this side, and then plant your seed. It's highly recommended to use a graceful set in this minigame, as it is quicker and faster because you will use uh, you will use your running a lot. But I do have a method. Oh yeah, by the way, I'm doing a zigzag motion. So you go left to right. So you go left to right. Go back left. Go back right. But yeah, like I said, graceful set is highly recommended. I do have a method where. You can, don't, if you don't have a graceful set, you don't have to use as much of your uh, stamina. But uh, I will not show that to you in this video. Maybe in an update video. So, once you're done with that, you want to run uh, north. And instead of the zigzag motion on this plot, you just want to go down. No more zigzag, just down. Just go down. Keep going down. Just keep going north until you're done. Once you're done with this area, 
turn behind you and then fill this plot. Now I go up. Now I go south. And these plants do grow quick, so you gotta be on the, on the rush. Now you wanna go across and use the bottom part and continue going south. See what I mean by the rotation? Now that the first rotation is over, now I water the first seed that I put in, and then I go back to the zigzag motion. Now the second seed. Now the third seed on the left side. Now the fourth seed on the right side. Now the fifth seed on the, on the left side. Now the sixth seed on the right side. Now the seventh seed on the left side. Now the eighth seed on the right side. Now I go down, and now. Now, now it's just a down and up motion. Now keep going down, south, north. Keep going north. Perfect. Now turn behind you. Water that one, and now continue south. Now you have to go up. Now cross. Continue upwards. This is my pattern. I did a zigzag down and up motion. Now if water the one you first planted, and the same thing, the same thing, rinse and repeat. Left, right, or left, right, left, right, left, <laughs> right. See these things are fucking going quick. Now I'll go down. That's honestly all there is to it, guys and gals. It's pretty easy. That's simple. If you go on the RuneScape wiki and look up tip farming, there is another. There's also other patterns you can use, but I found this pattern to be more comfortable to me. So that's why I'm doing it this way, and I hope this does help you because it did help me when I read this online. I just thought I would share this knowledge with you guys. Now you just harvest the first seed that you planted. Boom, now you got 24. Farming XP, another 24 or 23. If you're wearing a full farmer's outfit, like I said, you do get more XP. Primarily, how the graceful set works. If you have a graceful set, you want to wear the graceful set first and then equip the farmer's outfit when you get to the harvesting section as you get more XP. So graceful set when you're when you're watering the plants, farmer set when you're harvesting. Right, basically. So like I said down, you turn behind you, harvest that, and you continue south. And that's basically it. It's that easy, simple, not hard at all. And I'm gonna show you where to put your, your fruits at. Those things you're harvesting. You also got water bills uh, throughout the map for you to uh, recharge your watering can. And so you just go to this, wherever you see these sacks, these look, look like wheat grain sacks. You just click, left click your plants, your fruits, left click your sack. Bam! 4,715 XP I got from that one run. Just like that, easy. I believe you get forty thousand per run after seventy-four. Uh, after level seventy-four, if you farm these seeds, I forgot what they are uh, below, and I, I forgot what the XP rates are for the other seeds. But for the for the level seventy-four seeds and above, it is like I think thirty-five k to forty k XP per uh, per full hundred seeds that you fully harvest. And that's basically it guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick tutorial on how to do tip farming. And if you enjoyed the video, leave a like and a comment, and uh, as always, thanks for watching, bless your face.